This image occasionally pops up online as being the lost Thunderbird photo. It's actually cropped from the cover art for Strange Magazine No. 21, a digital-only edition from Fall 2000 that contained the first part of editor Mark Kervinsky's extensive report on the Thunderbird photo, Cowboys and Dragons. Nowhere in the pages of Strange Magazine was this image ever presented as being a real candidate for the photo. In actuality, this stunning image was created by Strange Magazine's art director, Greg Snook. He utilized a 3D computer model of a pterodactyl, textured it and rotated it for use as both the image of the Thunderbird flying and suspended from the barn wall. For the Cowboys, Snook created a composite from several vintage photographs. He said he only noticed later that one of the men in the image is actually Calamity Jane, the cover was a layering of several elements in Photoshop, with various effects applied to individual layers. The finished cover evoked the feeling of flipping through a stack of old adventure magazines and stumbling across the Thunderbird photo. The artist slyly included the Argosy magazine logo visible on another magazine poking out from the pile. Snook generously shared his original version of the Thunderbird photo seen here as it looked before its integration into the strange magazine cover.